11 months ago, Julia and Connie approached us and said, we have this idea, and we think that Chicago Public Library might have the same vision we do for how you take digital media and you incorporate it into a wider learning opportunity for kids and for teens. And what you see tonight, 11 months later, is that creation come to fruition. This space was really the brainchild of the MacArthur Foundation. MacArthur did the concept, the design, the build out, but the Pearson Foundation brought us the technology and they are an invaluable partner of this. This is not just a fun place for kids to play. This is a real place based on rigorous research that we are putting to the test. We are in New Media, which is our new space for teens in our central library, the Harold Washington Library Center. What happens in here is creativity. It really allows the library to be seen by teens as a place where they can give a full license to their creativity, whether it's in uh, their love of literature, poetry, music, um, or their desire or interest in using technology and digital media to express themselves creatively. It sits at the hub downtown. It sits across from at least four to five universities. It sits at the intersection of all of our public transportations. And it sits in a place where every kid, regardless of where they live in the city, can come. It also sits on the ground floor of a vast uh, array of resources, books, um, music collections, video collection, a hub of information about the history of Chicago and the history of the world. And one of the things we learned from the kids is that in many respects school is a node on their network of learning. And so part of what we've been trying to do is to think about how do you build the infrastructure for a young person's network of learning. They're learning not anywhere, anytime. And it turns out the library is one of those spaces. We were very upfront about no matter how we designed the space, the most important thing would be the quality of the mentors and the librarians to encourage students to take advantage of the space. Well, growing up on the south side of Chicago, uh, kids need an outlet to express themselves. If, if they don't have that outlet, they turn to the alternative. So this space gives kids the, the outlet that they need. I mean, they can pretty much come down here and construct some type of media to express themselves with. So if kids like to do graphic arts to be more creative, or if kids like, like to make movies or music videos or write songs, do poetry, they, they have a space that they can come down here and do that. One of the things we've learned from the research is that kids learn best when they're following their own interests and their own passions. And we think every kid that walks in the door is going to have their own interests and passions. As soon as they start pursuing their interests, they're going to have a set of questions and want to get better at something. And that's the hook. That's the connection to a mentor who can say, you know what, here are some things that you can do. My future goal is to be a music producer and to start off in hip hop, but not just stay in there like forever. I want to go into different genres and learn about everything, so I just won't be stuck in one mindset. I think making sure you present students with the challenge of not just saying go deep into one field, one trajectory. So do more than just be an expert music producer, but also spend some time on your writing, spend some time exploring video production, game design, etc. So I think even if they don't do any of those, you know, five years from now in terms of exploring a career path, there's definitely a skill set and a disposition that's built there that comes out of that process. So we try to maintain that um, in our programming in whatever context it may be. It really changes what the library means inside the community and what it means for the kids who come here. It used to be, I think, that kids would come to the library to take information and bring it home. And what we think now is that the kids will be bringing information to the library and using the center here as a way to be able to distribute and share what they know with other kids, other kids who come to the center and other kids in the city. Yes, I'm Prince Rock, I'm about to go on. Yes, I'm, high. I'm about to show you that my flow is never can it be your stop. Yes, I'm higher than the sky, and I am too fly, and my feet never